Welcome to PC Mac. In today's video, I'm going to install MB server on our Raspberry Pi 4 4GB version. By installing MB, we can stream our data across the network and we can watch movies, TV shows from any device in our home with the help of this MB server. MB is basically a media server that will help us to manage our media on Raspberry Pi and then we can stream it on any device that we have in the same network. So let's do it. First of all, let's just go ahead and log into the open media world. Then we will move forward and configure the MB. So open media world is up and the port in is also up. Now let's just go ahead and connect to our Raspberry Pi using PowerShell. Let me make it a little bit big from here. So we are connected to the Pi using PowerShell. Now let's just go ahead and open the website for MB. So we are going to use the default image. You can also use the Linux server image if you want. Both the images are available. This one is updated nine days ago. And the content of this one is also updated. So you can either use any one of the image. I will leave the link of both the images in my website. You can go ahead and use it from there. So we are going to use the command line to configure MB. So we are going to just copy this whole command from here and put it on notepad and then make some changes. So the whole command is right here and we need to configure it from the top. So the first path is program data and that is the configuration for MB and then the two share folders. One is this one and other one is this one. So we are going to configure these data right here. For that we need to go again to open media wall then shared folder and from here we need to copy the absolute path. One is for the containers and other one is for media. So first of all let's just copy the container path. Under container, we will create one more folder. Under that, we have program data and that will be mapped to config. After that, we'll put the share folders here. So let's copy the other path, the media one. So instead of share one, we'll make one for TV and one for movies. So let's paste here. Let's access the Samba server media and here is the uh, movies and TV series. So we'll take this movies from here. After media, we have the movies folder. And then the second one is the TV series folder. So the two directories are right here. Now let it be as it is net host. So these are the ports published 8096 and 8920. And here is the UID and GID. So let's just go ahead and check the UID and GID. The command is really simple. You just need to put ID and the username. So my name is case sensitive PC Mac. So that's why. So UID is 1001 and GID is 100. UID is 1001 and it's 100. So let's just copy the whole command and paste it here. I think there is some mistake. Let's just do it one more time. Check the command. I think there is some problem with this image. Let's try the Linux server one. So let's configure it. GID is 100. For the time zone, you need to check from here. Go to date and time and here is the time zone. Copy it from here and then paste it here. Then the config path and then the volumes. One is for the movie and other one is for the TV series. 
now we can remove the optional ones and just copy the command one more time and run it here and as you can see unable to find the image locally so it will download the image it's a small image so might take a moment and in between let's go back to portainer and refresh so the image downloaded and installed successfully let's just go back here and refresh and let's see whether it's available or not so it's available right here and available on port 8920 so the web ui is available on 96 and https is available on 8920 so we'll try this one so the server started let's just go ahead and select the language english united states next a username and next now the libraries so we have connected the movies so here are the folders we need to click on that and the folder that we have added is right here data movies and ok a new library for the TV shows add the folder and select TV shows from here ok ok next English United States ok next accept the policies next and finish once we do that and click on our username and put the password in it will start scanning everything on the system and you can see I have some TV shows available here the old TV shows let's just click on one and check whether it's playable on so it's working so let's and any movies here TV shows so it's working so you can check on your Raspberry Pi try to install the MB server if you face any problem you can write me down in the comment section that's it in this video please share this video with your family friends that will help us to grow this channel and if you like our content please hit the like button subscribe to our channel and press the bell notification for my latest videos thank you for watching bye bye take care have a nice day